Hello and welcome to the evening show. My name is Christopher Hay. I will be your host tonight. And boy, boy, we have a great show for you tonight. And we got breaking news out of Canada. Not that. Not that either. There we go. Ragu pasta sauce is no longer in Canada anymore. When discovered, netizen sent the company questions on Twitter, asking where the sauce went. The company issued a response as such. You come to me and ask of me this favor, and this is the day of my daughter's wedding. And you do not show respect. You do not even have the courtesy to call me Papa Ragu, the tasty. Because of your disrespect, I regret to inform you that Papa Ragu, the tasty, has made the hard decision to exit the Canadian pasta sauce market. We hope that you have enjoyed the delicious taste of Papa Ragu the Tasty, and are very sorry for any inconvenience. For further questions, please visit our website at bit.yl Actually, that's ly forward slash 31 g5 ob he. What did I stutter? The news of the pasta sauce departure has rippled through the aisles of the supermarket, and in the cutthroat world of pasta sauce, we are all left to wonder who will win the game of sauce. Now on HBO. In other news, a ninja museum in Japan was the target of a robbery. Ironic that a museum that showed off the art of theft concealment and black ops tactics was robbed. Or is that more poetic justice? The thieves got away with about 1 million yen, which is about 10,000. The thieves struck under the cover of darkness and used all the stealthy techniques they had learned over the years. I wonder where they picked up those skills. Oh well. The police, upon investigation, found that they used the ancient ninja technique of prying the door open with a crowbar. The Japanese police have announced that they dispatched their best ninja martial arts crime units. I can't wait to see the arrest video. And now it's time for... The Tabloids. Trudeau gets ready to visit the Corona Research Lab. NASA announced that they used the Hubble telescope and state-of-the-art life-detecting software, but still could not find the Conservative Party leadership. Alright guys, here's how we're going to fund the wall. First, you're going to give a dollar. Then you're going to ask two friends to give a dollar. And then they're going to ask two friends to give a dollar. And eventually we'll have the money. Meanwhile, Joe Biden talks about the time he won a blue ribbon at the county fair, Jack. And then finally, <laughs> powerful speech. Anyway, that's our show for you tonight. See you next week. Goodbye.